This is me. 16 years old and going away for a long time. I never wanted to be like this. All I ever wanted to do was help my mom. Somewhere along the way, it all fell apart. I guess it's just another day in paradise. It all started when my mom got sick. Doctor said it was something called lupus. I didn't know what that was. All I knew is my mom wasn't doing too good and she wasn't getting any better. Bills kept piling up, rent kept coming. We just didn't know what to do. All my mom kept saying was how we would lose our apartment and how our family would be destroyed. Yo, I'm tired of seeing my mom in pain. I can't get no job though, I'm only 16. My mom, she's too sick to work. But you know what, I told her I would get that money. I promised her, somehow. mistake of my life I told everybody not to move all I wanted was the money to be honest I was just as scared as they were I knew these cops would come after me sooner or later I had to get out of there they wouldn't understand that it was just an accident I went to the only place I knew I might be safe. That was Trey's house. He was an old Mac from way back. He was strange though. He wore a cape and had golf clubs. But I bet he never played a hole in his life. Yo, Trey. Yo, I'm in a lot of trouble, man. Yeah, I told him how I robbed the store to get money from my mom. But I accidentally shot somebody. And I knew the cops would be looking for me. Come on, man. I demand an explanation for these shenanigans, baby. What you got to say about that? Let them cops come on, baby. Oh, man, man. He shouldn't have hit me like that. But you know what? Aside, he said he would let me stay here. Good evening, man. Good evening. You know where we can find your son? No, he's not here. You know anywhere we can find him? Um, I think it's in Maywood. Thanks for your cooperation. Okay. Have a good evening. Being stuck in this house had me going crazy. Everything went through my mind. My sick mom. The police looking for me. I was just wondering how I got myself into this. But to be honest, I was just scared. And then I heard the knock on the door. Yes, I knew it was over. Have you seen this man? Uh, just... Nah, nah, nah. Wrong house, man. Maybe down the block or something now. Nah. Hold on a second. It was the end of the line. I made my choice, and now I have to live with it. What hurts the most, though, is that I let my mom down. I tried my hardest to help her, but I just couldn't handle the situation I was putting. 